Hi everyone and welcome to Easy Trading Computers. This is our quick tip video series. In each of these videos, I will show you step by step how to perform configurations and customizations to save you time at your trading computer. In today's video, I want to show you how to use Google Chrome and any web page that you frequent and turn that into an app. Now, first let me say, why would you do this as a trader? Well, you can see down here in my taskbar that I have many applications I refer to often. Let's say TradeStation as my software brokerage platform. Let's say Easy Breakouts as my go-to place for stock trading tools and tips and daily stock tips. Also Investor Business Daily for market direction and charts. Now, what I can do is use this hidden feature in Google Chrome to transform any web page into an application that I can switch to more easily. Because what I want to do is be able to uh, maybe even use a shortcut like Alt Tab. If you press down the Alt key and the Tab key and cycle through, you can switch easily between applications. So I could have up multiple different websites as applications and I could switch to Easy Breakouts real fast. I could switch to Investors Business Daily real fast. So how do you do this? What you're gonna to do is go to a website that you frequent. In this example, I'm gonna to go to investors.com. You could do anything, Wall Street Journal, CNBC, whatever news research site you use, stock charting site, your software brokerage platform, whatever. Go to the three dashed lines, upper right corner, below the red X, left click. Mouse down to more tools. Once the next submenu comes up, mouse down to add to taskbar. Then you'll get a little icon that represents the website and you can rename it. And I'm gonna call it IBD. Now you might not have this open as new window checkbox. You might not have it checked. Check that box. Then click add. Already two things have happened just in that one simple step. Number one is I now have the website IBD, Investors Business Daily, or Investors.com as an application. So I can just close the window and I can launch Investors.com, no problem. Let's do another one just so you can see once more how it works. Open Google Chrome. Go to a website that you like. I'm going to go to CNBC.com. Let it load. Okay, this is a website that I want to refer to often. So I click over to the right under the red X drop down menu appears and I go to more tools and then I go to add to taskbar. And now you can see that I get a pop up that says add to taskbar. I get the icon representing CNBC and I'm going to call this CNBC. I'm going to rename it. I'm going to leave open as a window checked. Click add. Now I can close Google Chrome and see that both investors.com and CNBC come up no problem. You can also see that I can use my Alt key and Tab at the same time. I can switch between these windows. So I could easily switch between two just using that keystroke. Now there's a couple more things that we could do. Let's close these apps, my CNBC app and my Investors.com app. I'm going to go back to Google Chrome. I'm going to load the default home page and click in the upper left corner apps. Now you can see that IBD and CNBC have become an app even on my uh, applications homepage for, for Google Chrome. Another thing though I could do is right click, right click on my new IBD app and I could create shortcuts and I could put one on the desktop, the start menu, and I already have it in the taskbar. So now IBD will go on the desktop. You can see it's right here. So I'm going to close Google Chrome for a minute. I'm going to double click my shortcut on my desktop and now IBD is a desktop app. It's also been put in my start menu. Now if I go to all programs and I click on Chrome Apps, you can see that it also appears here. Let's do it once more. I go to apps, then my CNBC app that I created. I right click on the app icon, click create shortcut. I leave checked off desktop, start menu, and pin to taskbar. I click create. Now I close Google Chrome and confirm I did it correctly. CNBC is on my desktop now. 
and it loads with just a double click. I can also navigate to All Programs under Start Menu, Google Chrome Apps, and CNBC is also there. I'll do it one final time using CNN.com. CNN.com. I load it in Google Chrome. I click on the three stripes in the upper right corner of Google Chrome. I go to More Tools. I go to Add to Taskbar and I call this CNN. I click and leave checked off Open as Window and click Add. Close Google Chrome and now CNN is in my taskbar. If I wanted to, I can reopen Google, Google Chrome, go to Apps, right click, create shortcuts, left click, create desktop and start menu icon. Now CNN is on my desktop and also in my start menu, all programs, Google Chrome, CNN. Now I can click on CNN and pin to start menu. The next time that I go to my start menu, it's right there. If I want to remove it at any time, I click unpin by right clicking, unpin from start menu, right click, unpin from start menu, and now those are removed. I can also right click, unpin from this taskbar, repeat that as needed, and I can also go back to apps, remove this from Google Chrome. So I will not use CNN anymore, remove this from Google Chrome, and it is now no longer an app in Google Chrome, and it's no longer an app in my taskbar. I hope this quick tip helped you today. Thanks for watching this video at Easy Trading Computers, and we'll see you next time.